So am I on right now? Good morning, everyone, and welcome to your 2024 Scottish Cup plate final between Glasgow Mets and Edinburgh Nuvok. My name is Danny Trailer. I am the women's national team head coach, and this is my first time doing live commentary of a volleyball match. So. Please forgive me if it is not the best, but we will see how we get on, okay? So we've got a good match for you this morning, and we will see how it goes. Looks like Nuvok are gonna be serving first. So first server up. pass there. Big swing right down the line to start the match from Alex Dickinson there. Great pass, nice controlled set and a good swing down the line to start the game. <coughs> Alex was previously part of the Scottish national team a few years ago. Recently just come back up to Scotland from being down at Northumbria. Nice pass there. Big block. Oh! Big block, but some nice cover from Nuvok and get away with the point there. Excellent. <laughs> okay, here we go. Anna Fisher serve. Setter for Nuvok here. Looks like she's going to go down the line. Nope, cross court. And we have an ace. Tough serve there, serving in the channel of the Libero on the outside here. Let's see if she goes after the same target again. She does just a little bit deep this time. Doesn't put the serving passing unit under any pressure at all. Alex Dickinson back to serve. Let's see if she can get her team on a run here. And that is deep as well. So that's back-to-back -back serving errors from both teams. And here we have Gabby serving for Nuvok. Oh, off the tape, and it's down. Nothing much Mets could do about that one. Don't think she's going to try that one again, but you never know. And that one was out. He's backed up with an error. Not the best combination. Soon for Mets, we have number 13, middle Megan Kerr. Nice tip, a good block. <clears throat> Big swing. Great pickup. Great pickup. Free ball over. Not the best ball control there. Let's get under control. Good swing, nice pass under control. Big swing over the block, but nicely controlled by number four, Alex Dickinson. Some excellent hustle from both teams here. I think we just got tired there. Great rally, lots of big swings, with some even better defense. So Mets are a club that have been around for a long time, but this is their first year as a women's team in the last few years. They restarted a lot of the girls, I think, from Glasgow University, wanted to uh, play some club ball. So they kind of put a club together, and as you, we can see from starting lineup and the fact that they've got nearly 
eight people on the bench as well. They've got a big squad, so I know that next year they're looking to have two teams. So if you're in Glasgow and you're looking to play, give them a call. Big swing out the back row. Nice pipe swing from Alex Dickinson there. <coughs> I think Mets are going to rely quite heavily on her today. She's got a heavy arm swing. Puts the opposition under a lot of pressure. OK, serving for Mets, we have Dylan de Guzman. She played for the Scottish students yesterday morning when they managed to beat a Scotland Selects game 3-0. Nice tip, great pick up. Bellies Christensen. Did she touch it? Did she touch? No, she didn't. That was straight down. Next to serve for Nuvok, we have Antonina Porsche. Came through the youth system at Nuvok, one of the younger players on the team, which is great to see. Good dig from her there as well. Uh, it's a double there from Anna Fisher. Needs to get her feet set under that one. Number three to serve, Rachel Underwood. Nice pass by Gabby. Oh, big swing. Anna Fisher makes up for the previous double on that one. Nice controlled set up to Annalise Christensen. Just bombs the ball over the block into the back part of the court. Excellent swing. Annalise goes, eh, Elise goes back to serve now. Can she back up that big swing with a tough serve? She can. Not controlled by the Lee Broats. Looks going to be a free ball. Controlled there. Oh, second ball. Oh, that was cheeky. A little bit of a discussion now between Mets about who's taking that. I think you've all just got to go for it. Can't just sit and watch. That's an ace. Just drilled it straight there, front court passer, put her under pressure. She can't deal with it. Good pass by the Libero. Oh. Another nice block by Nuvok there. And that is a timeout for Glasgow Mets. 11-5 down, so it's a tough run there. Be nice to get over there and hear what they're saying just now. From the look of it, the Nuvok coach Max seems to just be telling the team to calm down just a little bit. Control the pass, it looks like. Pretty easy team talk for Bill. Just tell the team to stay relaxed and keep doing what they're doing. Back on the court they come. Elise serving again. How's she going to do after the timeout? Always a tough time to come back on the court and serve after a timeout. Good serve, though. But an even better pass and swing by Alex Dickinson to get the point back. She's put under pressure under on, the, on the receive. Did a good job controlling the ball to Mars Hood. And then she gave the ball straight back to Dickinson with a nice swing. We have Barbara Istanvan Jova serving here. Oh, in the net. Not great. And off she goes. Back onto the bench for a little break. And on comes the Libero, number 14. That is Patricia Trott. She is the captain for Mets. Deep serve right down the middle, though. Easily passed. And Alex again with a big swing down the line, but that was Doug. Nicely controlled. Porsche with a good swing. Oh, oh, use the net band. You've paid for the net, so you might as well use it. That was a good swing by Rachel Underwood. 
Cristo. Served by Mars Hood. <laughs> oh, big paintbrush by Elise, but it's worked. Nice set behind. Oh, controlled swing, not controlled as well. It should be there. Got the ball under control here. Good. Using the pipe. Great swing. A lot of power there. Both teams seem to be relying quite heavily on their outside hitters at the moment, so giving the ball to four or giving the ball to pipe, it'll be interested to see if teams start to adapt to that or they, and they have to adapt to what they're doing on their side of the offense. Just as we say that, they run the middle, but Annalise Pedrotti just puts the ball into the bottom of the net. Probably needs that a little bit higher. A little bit further out, you don't often see lefty middles. Makes it a little bit complicated to get the connection between the two players. Tough serve. Pulls the set out of the pocket, she runs pipe again. Control swing by De Guzman. That's what we need, that's a better swing. Dog go, controlled. Ball goes to four. Big swing by Gabby off the top of the block. Block slows it down nicely. Alex Dixon going line again off the block. Nice swing. It's down. Now, oh, that timeout for Mets previously worked really well. They've now pulled the game back to two, so they're only 12 10 down now. So it's Bill Skelly from Nuvok who's taking the timeout this time. Bill's time to get his team worked up here. Max seems to be happy, a lot of hand clapping. Time out, Marshall. Deep serve. Good, good pass though by Alice Christensen. Good set, but under pressure, Gabby's just standing hitting. The drive with the tip, and there was no touch. No touch. We have said Nuvok need to run, both teams need to run the middle. Nuvok have done that, but they've had three swings in the middle, two errors and one dug by Metz, so see what happens here. Pretty sure if we get a good pass, Metz, Nuvok will go to the outside. Ooh. Well, I'm not sure what the line judge saw there. From up here, that definitely looked like it was in. The referee's closer as well. Albert Jasta has been refereeing for a long time, so he's got a lot of experience. Oh, off the tape. Boom, Anna Fisher again off the top of the taper in. I think that's Nuvok got two of them. Anna Fisher with a serve. Same target as before, into that seam between the Libero and the outside hitter. Free ball over, obviously put him under pressure. Pedrotti again, there we go. She found the middle and she found the swing. High off the hands, successful. Nuvok building that lead again. Another good timeout from coach Bill Skelly. Same target for Anna Fisher. Seem to be picking on that Libero, which is interesting tactic. She seems to be controlling the ball pretty well. Free ball from Nuvok. Mate's got the chance here. Tip by De Guzman. She needs to start swinging. She's not scoring yet. 
free ball from Metz. Leave it scrappy there. Oh, oh, oh. She's back row. Don't think that'll be allowed. Yep, she was over. Apologies, ref. I was a little bit quicker than you there. Okay. Alex Dickinson back to serve. How will Metz cope with her in the back row? She's been scoring a lot when she's been at front. Nice serve, but a good pass by the Libero for Nuvok. Big swing by Gabby, but straight in the middle of the court, easily dug. Big swing. Big swing, great dig, and then a great swing by number three, Rachel Underwood. Mets are definitely very strong on the outside with Alex Dickinson and Rachel Underwood as the two main hitters. Deep serving in the corner. Nice pass by Gabby. Tip. Two tips back to back. We're going to go for three in a row or someone's going to hit it. Oh no, just a free ball this time. Oh, we've ran the middle. Not the most successful one. Outside. Oh, she got it. Down the front of the block. Block didn't get finished. That's quite a big block as well. Gabby's got some height on her. And then Annalise Pedrotti, she jumps out of the gym. Jump float here again from Alex Dickinson into that deep corner, straight down the Liberals' throw, but not controlled. Gab with a big high swing, straight in the middle of the court again, right Alex Dickinson. Big swing, but a lot of big defence. Cross court, Nuvok under a little bit of pressure here. Oh, oh. Bit lucky to get a score on that one, but got it all the same. Gabby back to serve. They've been relying on her heavily in the front row, so it'll be interesting to see what Nuvok do here. Straight down the middle at that Libero. And De Guzman with another roll shot. Inside ball, Elise Christensen with a good hard swing, but nicely blocked. Rachel Underwood down the line, that was out. It's a nice swing. I don't know if the defender left it or just... just got confused and got out of the way. Seems to be an interesting tactic here from Nuvok. They seem to be picking on the Libero, but at the moment she seems to be holding up. See if they start to change that serve and target they have. And that was successful. Maybe Bill Skelly's seeing the same things that I'm seeing up here. Libero was having success, so we need to change the serving target. Pick on Alex Dickinson and we get an ace out of it. Let's see, we're going to go after the same player again? Let's hope so. Back to the Libero. Not as well controlled as she has been. Roll shot over under control. It's gone to four. At least Christensen off the top of the tape. Free ball. Controlled by Nuvok behind that's a bit wide, put under pressure, but good swing by the lefty. Bit scrappy from Nuvok, okay. Let's see if we can get under control here. Nice pass. Cross court swing. Straight the Libro. Good dig. And a fish for a nice stable setup for Elise. And she gets housed. The Guzman is pretty excited about that one. Jumping up and down like a jackrabbit. <laughs> okay, we have number 13 to serve. This is Megan Kerr. Middle. Good pass by the Libero. Maybe a bit tight, put them under a bit of pressure, a bit scrappy. Still get a swing at all. I think she tried to control that one down the line, didn't quite catch it properly. <coughs> Mets seem to be having the same tactic there, going after the Libero. Agnieszka Zitak for Nuvok. She seems to be doing a decent job as well. See if they stick with the same tactic. 
It's straight down the middle. Oh. We have a rotation fault here. Second ref wanting to insert himself in the game. Bit of time we can chat about the referees just now. I think we have Albert Jaster on the stand. He's been referee, elite, refereeing for as long as I can remember. Before I was born, probably. Retired teacher, used to work with my dad. If anyone's interested in that sort of thing. Alex Boysel's the second ref. Recently qualified grade two referee. From Edinburgh Uni. Still has two years in, at uni, so probably see him around the league in Scottish volleyball for the next couple of years at least. So I think we had a let there. Oh, oh, power tip. Big swing straight through the block. Nice job coming after all that pressure, all that confusion at the score table. Good serve and then from number 13, Megan Kerr. Nuvok didn't deal with it particularly well and then Metz were able to win the point. So, time out for Nuvok, 18-17. So we are going to be here all day today. We have got our plate, women's plate final going on just now. After this game, we will have our men's plate final, which will be between Premier League Dundee and SVL1 team Forza Ragazzi. They'll be playing after this match. Then the third game of the day will be City of Edinburgh versus... Surigazi on the women's side and then we'll be having our final match of the day will be a Edinburgh Derby between City of Edinburgh and Edinburgh Nuvok. so that'll be if you've got nothing else to do today come down and join us and probably the best part about that is you won't have to keep muting me and you'll just get to sit and watch the game without listening to me waffle on all the time Mets are still on a good serve and run here Megan Kerr still at the line that's a good deep serve. Good swing by Elise, that was out. I thought there might have been a touch. I thought there was a touch. Mm. Mets look a bit confused about that one. Nuvok, not too happy about that decision. But both lines are just set out. First ref, second ref, didn't see it. Mets take the lead. That was a clever play. Clever play by a setter, Anna Fisher, and middle, Annalise Pedrotti, as the lefty is pretty hard in through the middle. So to counteract that one, she ran behind the setter there, was able to open up the court, realised there was a lot of space in four and just tipped the ball over the block. Excellent. Pedrotti, normally a right side for Nuvok. Seems to be playing middle today. I'm not sure if they've got a few injuries and a few missing players, but obviously she's doing a decent job through the middle, holding her on there. So scores 2019 to Nuvox getting to that pressure point of the match. Who's going to come out on top? Deep serve, putting Rachel Underwood under a little bit of pressure. Oh dear. Just a little bit too much there from Alex Dickinson. Just pushes it a little bit too wide. Mets need to control the pass here. They need to get out of this rotation. Need to get Annalise off the service line. She's putting too much pressure on them. Good serve, nice pass. Good save behind the Guzman with a big swing. Excellent, she's very excited. First time she's unleashed that full arm swing today. And first time she's got a kill. Good job. Now, has she excited herself too much? She's going to put this. She better put this one in. Good serve. Putting Elise Christensen under pressure. Pulls Anna Fisher out of the pocket. 
Gabby with a big cut shot from the pipe. De Guzman too excited after her big swing and her big serve, and then totally forgets that she's meant to play defense. Okay. Antonina Porsche back to serve. Big lefty serve in the seam, and she gets an ace out of it. A little bit of confusion between number three and number four for Mets there. Rachel Underwood saying, that's my ball, and apologizing for that mistake. So we have Nuvok have Ne have won this competition four times. So they have won the plate four times, most recently in 2003. So they're looking to add to that tally. Mets, on the other hand, never won the plate. So it would be great if they, for their first time in the club, especially their first year back in Scottish volleyball as a women's team, it would be fantastic to see them get the trophy here today. OK, after the timeout, Porsche going to deal with the pressure of well. How's she going to get on? Big deep serve. Good. Nice control pass, though. Rachel Underwood with a big swing off the block. She's been using those hands well all day. And high off the hands and away, so the defenders have got no chance. She's back to serve now. Serving from five. And she's going to go down the line between six and one. See if my guess is right. Nope, I think she's already changed her mind. Put them under pressure. Oh, she made a good dig there. Ball's gone to four. Dickinson cross court. Excellent swing. Straight to the Libero, but the Libero couldn't deal with it. Too much power. 23-22. Back in it. Back in it. So let's see if I get this one right. I think she's probably going to go back to the same place between six and one in between the two outside hitters. No, once again, I'm wrong. Straight to the Libero, controls the pass well. Gabby with a big swing out of pipe. Nuvox, it met set pipe. And they get a point there. Looks like the Libero seemed to tuck in a little bit, think she was going down straight down the middle. She cut it right to the sideline. 23 all. It's getting exciting. Sure you can hear all the people cheering. Oh, we got a sub here. Who do we have? We've got Elise Christensen coming off. And I think it is number nine. No, it's not number nine, it's number eight. Anna Andra Mishkova. I'm butchering a lot of names here, people, so I apologize if family members are watching. Good pass by Gabby, straight to the sub. On she goes, a wee pokey power tip. She must play some beach. Big swing back, out of the pipe, oh no! She puts it wide. Good service run, a few good plays, but no, nope, it's not gonna do it. That brings up set point for Nuvo. Now it's for Hannah, who's just come on. So she just tipped the ball over, she's had no match so far. Now we'll see what she does. Big jump, float serve, big serve, straight to the Libero. Not the best control, free ball. Nuvok seem to control it well, it's gone to four. Gabby, roll shot down the line. Well, Doug, Libero steps in to control that. Dickinson with a big swing, but a great dig by Han in the back row. Gabby with a tip, that, oh, that was probably going out, but it was well covered. Oh, oh, it's... Rachel Underwood swung it straight at the block, but the block did not push the hands over, and that went straight down. I think that Diana Castillo, number 18, yep, yeah, she needs to push her hands over a little bit more. Finish that block. Number two to serve, 24 all. Oh, she was running around there. Decent serve, cross court, Gabby swings straight through the block. Excellent cover by Rachel Underwood. Big swing by Dickinson. Oh, oh, no. That dig was just outside the antenna, put a lot of pressure on Anna Fisher to try and bring it back. Didn't have enough height to reach it and pull it back in the core there and ended up punching it straight into the antenna. So we now got set point for Mets. So straight down the middle of Libero again. 
Pulls Anna Fisher out of the pocket. Guy with the swing off the block. Mate's too slow to react. Clever swing. Waiting for the block to be on the way down and hitting the ball high off the block. Pushing out to the sideline. Number 18, Diana Hervas Castillo to serve. Serves straight, Alex Dixon, oh, that was an easy serve, probably should have controlled that one better. But good recovery. Good swing by Rachel Underwood. We have Mars Hood serving here, setter for Glasgow Mets. Nice pass, big swing by Gabby, and she gets blocked, but it's still alive. Huge block, and she gives it back to the Guzman, who's roll shots over the block. Going to four, Gabby with a big swing again over the block. Great touch, no, nearly. Oh, good hustle, great hustle. It was a great block, I think. Mets kind of lost their way in that rally. De Guzman got excited, thinks she got the block to win the set, but Nuvok played some excellent defense, keeping the ball alive. 26 all. Already past regulation. Anna Fisher serves in the gap. De Guzman smashes it through block. That looked like a bit of a lift. Oh, interesting play there. Net fault by Glasgow Mets. Called by Alex Boyso. Did look like it was a little bit of a lift from Annalise Pedrotti off the block. Some might call it an athletic play. Some might call it a lift. I'll let you decide. Anna Fisher serve, set point again. Straight down the throat of the Libero. Good set, giving it to Dickinson, who rolls over the top. Big pick up by the Libero, back to Gabby in four. Over the top of the block, under control. Goes pipe again to Underwood. Oh, bottom of the net band. Not a way you want to end the set. So final score of that set was 28-26 to Nuvo. Right, we have got three minutes before the next set starts. I'm gonna put myself on mute so that your ears don't bleed for the next three minutes and I'll give you a break.
All right, people, and we are back. You've had you a few minutes of rest. Now I'm back to hurt your ears again. We have the live chat up, so if anyone's watching on the live on the live stream, get your questions in there or comments. I'm sure I can read a few of them out. If you just want to say hello, you want to shout out friends and family, let me know. Okay, so we've switched ends now. We've got Mets at the far side. We got Nuvok this side. Let's see if we we got the same tactics. So Nuvok. <coughs> Nuvok, we're going to run the ball to the outside quite a lot, but Pedrotti in the front row. Mets seem to be going from the outside quite a lot. Let's see what happens here. Big deep serve just out. Number 30 nearly got in the way there. Christensen did a good job of leaving it and nearly hit Antonina, but she managed to get out of the way. Good job, weight dodge. Okay. Got Anna Fisher serving here. Set up from for Nuvok. Big serve. Good pass by Dickinson though. Bang. Straight down the line. Straight off the Libero. Libero didn't have any time to react there. Good swing. Dickinson back to serve after that nice swing. Let's see where she goes. Cross court, deep serving to Gabby in one. Good tip by Pedrotti, straight to Libero though. Swing by De Guzman, big block, net fall. <laughs> not allowed to do that. You are not allowed to touch the net. Okay. Let's see. Alex Dickinson serving one to one, putting pressure on Gabby. Nope. Seems to switch it up there, goes after Elise Christensen. Gabby with a big swing, but a nice touch off the block to slow her down. Then cross court from Rachel Underwood. Yeah, Gabby's pretty tall, reached that pretty well. Hit from <coughs> two to one. Very happy teammate and Elise, Pedro and Elise Pedrotti there lifting Gabby up. Gabby looked a bit scared. Thankfully, Pedrotti's quite strong, managed to keep hold of her. Okay, Gabby to serve here. Gabby used to be a middle, now seems to be converted to being an outside. Might be something to do with a lot of the beach that she plays over the summer months. Big swing, that, oh! Cross court hit there from Annalise. Cl 